Hi, it's Paul here from HowToNetwork.net. It's Thursday, 25th of February. In fact, let me double check. Yeah, still the 25th. Maybe different where you live because we have people uh, getting this tip from all over the world as far as New Zealand, uh, Australia, America, uh, India, all sorts of countries. But where I am, it's the 25th. It's the 150th HowToNetwork.net tip of the day. Someone asked me to write some articles about how to get into IT consulting because they don't know where to start. I'm going to post up three links uh, here on the video. Uh, the guy, uh, my a business partner who bought my former training company from me has posted three really good articles and he's done a lot of uh, network consulting over the past 15 years. So I'll post them up. Good news, uh, so far in the last week we've had nine members pass Cisco exams, most of them CCNA and some of them are passing the CCMP modules as well. So I'm really pleased. So I'm going to post up uh, some names. The latest two are Richard Robinson, Robertson who passed his CCMP routing exam and Russell Painter. Uh, Russell has posted a really useful comment on um, how he passed because he's sitting next to someone at work who, who hasn't done the exam yet and uh, what he had to say is quite interesting. It prompted me to update a blog on paulbrowning.com which is called The Secret to Success and um, I'll post up the link for that here as well. Apologies for those of you who are waiting for some lectures to be added to the site. I'm basically been proofreading Cisco CC and A Voice Simplified um, and also uh, getting some some of the things finished for the site but I'll start posting lectures again next week. Uh, the flight to the UK competition we've had one guy who's already entered and passed the exam so um, I'll put up the link here as well I do encourage you to join that competition if you're a member of the site because if you're the winner I'll fly you to the UK and you can come on a Cisco course and I'll pay. Alright, so the site basically howtonetwork.net exists to help you through your Cisco exams and doing that will hopefully protect you from redundancy, help you improve your earning capacity and um, have a beneficial effect. So the best way to, to do all that is to basically join the site. I don't know of any other site on the internet that offers better value for money and more resources. You can buy obviously all the things you need, but you need to go to several different sites or companies and pay several hundred dollars for the privilege. When you join, please post on the forum. We love to help people on the forum. Nobody um, has any egos there and we're all there to do the same thing and help you pass. Uh, make sure you book your exam uh, for 60 days time. There's a 60 days to CCNA program on the site that's free. I've posted up the CCNA Voice Labs. All you need to do is come to howtonetwork.net, click on CCNA Voice Labs or C Voice Labs, they're called on the site. Uh, the other thing is, somebody's asked me, do people self fund their CCIE studies? That's a really good question because it, I think the cost can come in at around $20,000, maybe more, maybe less, it just depends. That's for your books, study resources, going on a training course, and then actually taking the exam, which costs, last time I checked, $1,500, but it could cost more now. And sometimes you've got to fly to wherever the exam is to take it. Um, most companies do fund. CCIE uh, qualifications if it's relevant for what they do. Uh, the problem is if you get funded you are basically owned by the company for the next two years because you're not allowed to leave unless you pay them back for the studies you've done. So if you can self-fund I do highly recommend that. I'm going to post something on here soon about how our dual CCIE for ITAFA got through his um, CCIE and uh, how he did it. Alright so that's the end of the tip. It'll be the last tip of the week tomorrow so uh, have a great day. I'll see you then.